Welcome to the OpenMC monthly drop-in session. This is a quick tour of the Gather Town environment that we'll be using to host these sessions. And I've just clicked on the Gather Town link, and this is what you should see as a welcome screen. So the, the main thing to do here is just to click on the red button for the microphone, and that will enable the microphone. And then you will see that the permissions um, will be allowed by your browser for GatherTown to access your microphone. I won't actually do that because it will mess up this video recording, um, but you certainly should. And then join GatherTown. This will just take a few seconds to load. And if you do miss that microphone setting at the beginning, you can, um, you can go in here and grant it afterwards. Okay, as you can see, you appear on the left-hand side, side of the map, and you can move around using the arrow keys on your keyboard, up, um, right, down, left, everything. And the first thing you'll come into contact with is this uh, video screen. And that will bring up a little, a little link. You can interact with things by pressing X, or you can click on them and they expand. So I'll, I'll click on that. And this is the video I'm recording now. So it will allow you to know what to expect if you just arrive uh, without watching the video first. The second thing you come into contact with is, is, is an auditorium uh, where presenters and audience members can sit and listen to the presentations. The order of the presentations will be decided on the day because we might want to link similar topic, topics together but it's an opportunity for the developers to share the, the grand plans of what OpenMC is, is planning for next or in the long term and for community contributors to discuss ideas or um, pull requests that they would like to make. Anyway, when it's time to present, you should definitely make sure you're unmuted and you can do that um, in the bottom right corner by unmuting and then you can you can wander up to the screen and you should stand in the microphone box and now you're broadcasting to the entire screen and just down here there's a share screen button but before I click on it I am just going to close down the other 42 windows that I have open um, and there's a reason for this because when I click share screen it will ask me permission and it will say which screen or window and if I have 42 items on this drop down box it's very hard to find um, the PowerPoint or slideshow that you want to share in my case I just want to share the entire screen so I will click on entire screen and I shall allow that permission and we can see that goes into the browser permission so I've got the camera and I've got the screen share and you will also have the, the microphone as well, just I need it for the recording. Um, so my presentation is actually on another screen and you can see that this is this is now being presented. This is, uh, in general, my presentations will normally be shameless plugs for what I'm working on. Uh, this is the Neutronics Workshop, a hobby project for a few years now and it has a slideshow for anyone wanting to learn um, Neutronics simulations for fusion energy using OpenMC. So you whiz through your presentation and um, try to keep it to five minutes and then we will stop sharing the screen by clicking on that button again and we we'll step out of the microphone box and then we're, we're no longer broadcasting to the entire room and then we will exit the stage and again you have to exit using the staircases um, you can't actually access using the rest of the stage and then I'm gonna I'm gonna sit down in the audience and the next presenter and once we're all done um, you, you can ask questions um, at this stage but maybe a better no opportunity to ask questions is once we all move to the poster presentation so gather town is a is a great um, environment which allows you to chat with people who are close to you within proximity on the map. So if I move down here I can then talk with this person Lydia 
and she's standing in a little box next to a talk one and this is like a private zone box so only people in this highlighted zone can hear each other this just stops the conversations um, overlapping with with adjacent talks and then you could ask your questions and get your answers and you could move to the next presentation and uh, different presentations and you might notice each time I move to a presentation a different um, picture appears down at the bottom when the presentations are going somebody will be taking screenshots unless the presenter asks them not to take a screenshot they will upload a screenshot to these uh, posters and they'll be in the same order so you can interact with that screenshot by pressing X again and that will bring up um, the full screen of the slide so for presenters if you can cram all your material into a single slide that would make it very easy to turn into a, a little poster presentation and this one uses the Paramac which is another shameless plug so then I close that down and I might go and look at the other posters all very interesting and then there's other areas of the map to explore so this is the user support and you'll find a few people sitting here who will be able to answer your questions on installing how to install it what problems um, are you having problems with nuclear data downloading you can get support here um, there's also a, a opportunity for feedback and you can um, press X and it will take you to a URL where you can leave some feedback and there's other areas like this if you want to have a, a private chat you can go into this cone of silence so that's great um, looking forward to seeing how it works um, see you at the next monthly meeting